hello viewers welcome back to another section of my youtube channel tutorial in this video i'm going to take you through an interesting principle in mechanics called the principle of transmissibility so in mechanics as we have gone through in our previous videos that we deal with the forces acting on the body the interaction of these forces brings in what you call a line of force now, what does this principle state? The principle is saying that the conditions of equilibrium or motion of rigid body. So let's say the conditions of equilibrium or motion of a rigid body remain unchanged. That is the conditions we apply when you are considering equilibrium or a motion of a rigid body doesn't change if a force acting at a given point on the body is replaced so there is another key term so the conditions of equilibrium or motion doesn't change provided that a force acting at a given point on the rigid body is replaced by a force of the same magnitude so take note the force that is being replaced should be of the same magnitude and the same direction but the only difference is it is acting at a different point acting at a different point so these two forces they should act they should have the same magnitude the same direction but they are acting at a different point provided that the two forces have the same line of action so it's quite a long principle but its practical application is so simple i have a rigid body here when a force of magnitude f1 having a direction here is acting at this point there is an a virtual line of force so this is the part of the force we call it the line of force so the line of action of the force here the line of action of the force here whenever a different force is acting here and that force is also having a magnitude of f1 then the direction should be here so far as they are on the same line of action then the conditions applied in the simplification of this rigid body remain the same nothing changes but the condition is the true forces should lie on the same line of force and the direction should be the same you shouldn't have opposite direction now let's see i have a big car So this car I'm having here, there is a force F acting at this place called F. I can bring this force F to this side and draw my F, provided it is on the same line of what action and the direction is the same. Nothing changes. So I can change this here and clean it so that I can draw this place. So it becomes this way and it's also correct if you have maybe a bow and there is a reaction somewhere here ah this is the line of action of the rea reaction so you can bring the reaction up here and bring your r since it is in the same direction nothing changes and the magnitude should be the same so that's the principle of what transmissibility it helps us to change the position of what a force provided it is on its line of action we can change it to make simplifications easier to make how to handle a complex system easier so the two forces are what we call equivalent forces since they are acting on the same line of action they have the same magnitude and the same direction Thank you for watching this video. 
please join me in my subscription videos as we be going through problems in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.